This is a video about pressure. And if you've been anywhere for the last couple of years, I'm pretty sure that you've experienced some level of pressure. Scripture has a wealth of information and a wealth of advice for us about pressure. One of my favorite words in the Bible is actually tribulation. Tribulation, affliction, trouble, all these words that kind of go hand in hand. And whenever we look in the, the New Testament, the Greek word for that is philipsis. And it means, the definition is pressing, pressing together pressure. It is used as a metaphor, but a metaphor for what? What does it actually mean? And so I hope to show you through this video what affliction, oppression, and tribulation produces. We're the Pomeroy family. And for the last two years, we have been restoring an old orchard, an orchard that was lost and neglected, had been turned into wilderness, but still there were old, old apple trees that we've been told are at least 80 years of age, but they weren't producing any fruit. So we got in with all of our kids and all of our tools and we cleared them out and we pruned them. And for the first year since we've moved here, we have harvested our apples. We're going to the basement to juice our apples. When we moved into the property and we knew we would eventually have apples, we thought, why don't we buy a traditional press? And so that's what we did. And this is the first year we've had an opportunity to actually press fruit the traditional way, the way that they have been doing it for hundreds, if not thousands of years. So I hope you enjoy watching. Okay, so that's three kilos of that one. You wet it? I wet it out, yep. Three kilos of that And we put this guy on, which allows me to get a bit of pressure on that. Like that. Right, Yizzy, turn if you can. Other way, Yizzy. Other way. That's it. Come on, Yizzy. Kilos of chopped apples. Oh, wow. mm, it smells nice. Like used to be. <laughs> we put them in the press, which has been just freshly cleaned for the celebration. And then we're going to need to go and get more because that's only up to, you know, press down. It's only going to be up to my okay. <laughs>
it sit. And then you put the, these guys here. Like that. Put down the pressure plate on top like that. What's that called? This bit here's the pressure plate. And then you put down the plastic washer. Screw this guy down. If you don't, you bad things happen to girls that get hit by handles. No. Now, now, just should come out here so we move that thing back quite quickly. Right, Julie. This is a traditional apple cider press. I mean, drinking traditional apple cider. Now, tell me that there are never enough wooden blocks on these things to be them. We will find out. Quite a pressure on that. Is this some juice coming? Yeah. Oh, yay! Okay. Now we need to go back up here because we're at the full extent of that, so we go back up and add more blocks. This isn't unexpected, so I cut myself some blocks out of a bit of walnut earlier so I could do this. Lift the pressure plate. Thank you, Jacob. It is, as long as the blocks don't fall. Okay, so it's kind of in the middle of the day of jungle. Oh, here we go. Let us get far further down, of course. Which we will. I mean, don't we will should get all the juice out of this. That'll put more pressure on us right now. There's more juice coming out. Yeah, I see some. That's some of the orange juice from the camera, isn't it? Juice is coming out, so I don't know if it's leaking. Oh, 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 yeah. No, it's supposed to be. Oh, don't miss. The juice is coming. What? The juice. Apple juice. Cool. I think it's full of pork. It's like a river. Watch this. I'll hit my arm. It's like a river or something. It's like a waterfall. You can see it right there. That is it. And you can move your arm around. When we think of affliction and we think of tribulation, we think of trouble, we think of something that we want to avoid, but the metaphor doesn't reveal that the metaphor reveals something more this is about something being produced and so i like to think of the press the great press which would have been around in jesus time which we don't have a grape press we don't have grapes unfortunately we're stuck with traditional irish apples but the metaphor is still the same it is putting something in to this container and applying pressure and seeing what comes out Of course the main thing about pressure in a fruit press is that it's producing something that's really really good and that's what we have to keep in mind when it comes to our faith, when it comes to times of difficulty and times of trouble, God is trying to produce something good in us and, and everything that he does, everything he does is good.
left alone. My hope is found. He is my life, my strength, my soul.